Yeah, uh, I like to share our core values. Uh, yeah. Our core values are to be dedicated, to be authentic, to be resilient, and be thankful. Ooh, why? Why? How did you come up with those core values? When, how, take us through that process. Yeah, great question. Um, this is a great question. This is a great start. Uh, I, you know, we had we grew from a food truck in 2010 to having eight locations, and we have about. Today, about 130 staff. That's crazy. So uh, we understand that as we're growing, uh, I used to be with our staff every single day, right? Uh, Vice versa, our staff, the same staff, we're working together for eight, 10 hours a day, and sometimes maybe more. And today I'm removed from day-to-day operations. So it's much more important to uh, live by the core values Mm -hmm. and um, that our, th- that culture is, is being, uh, shared and that it's lived, uh, at our store level. So it's, it's very important. And, uh, over the years we accumulated these important things that we have within ourselves that, that represents like who we are as people. Yes. Uh, and we just put it on paper and, and uh, we said this is our company's core values. Yeah. W- the way I like to think of core values or a mission or a vision or all these things, it's literally taking yourself. That's right. And putting it onto paper because behind every great restaurant, it's a great person. Right? I agree. And great team. And like you said, right. you're up to 130 employees. We can yeah. only handle about 130, 150 relationships in all of our life. Wow. Right. So you yeah. can't make, you can't impose yourself on all those people at the same level that you were able to when you had three or four employees, right? right? So when you have three or four employees, you can literally imprint yourself on them, right? right? You can say, this is who I am and you can will yourself into them, right? Yeah. But when you have 130 people, you need to put it in writing. So it's there and set, right? Yeah. When did you realize you needed these core values? So uh, we've, we've always had it. We, we didn't know what to do with it. We didn't know how to use it. Uh, we started using our core values, uh, about a year and a half ago. And how we used it was through this uh, program called the EOS. And we use this um, program. Uh, and, and we now use our core values to hire people, promote people, fire people. Well, the uh, program EOS, is that entrepreneur's? Uh, operating system. Oh. Yeah. So is it entrepreneur's operating system? Or? Yes. Okay, cool. That's what it's called. <laughs> right. Just want to make sure I got that. Yeah. Um, so we we knew like we we knew how to intuitively knew how to uh, give raises to people uh you know it's it's a small business it's hard it's hard to fire people it's it's our least favorite job right like we hate yeah firing people uh we love to give second and third chances to to people even though they're not a great fit mm. uh we literally started using our core values on a, on a day-to-day basis and it's becoming so much impactful for us. And that's why this is, um, I love it. 